Indeed. Yeah, nice that. spread. Mm -hmm. Bill, fashionably late as usual. <laughs> oh, it's uh, my fault, I'm afraid. Bill took a detour to my house. I'm David Clark. I, I work with your husband. Happy New Year, Mr. Clark. How is it we haven't met before? David's not much for parties. Perhaps if you acquired shares in that mentality, your star would be rising as fast as David's. All work and no play. Where's the fun in that? <laughs> but excuse me, I'm gonna get a drink. David just moved into the beach house next door. Oh, so you're the one. Well, welcome to the neighborhood. It's a beautiful property. Well, it will be eventually. It needs work. But uh, I'm afraid uh, all I could afford was a fixer. But it felt right. Felt? How refreshing. As I understand it, we only buy properties if the tax incentives work for us. You know what, uh, Rudy just walked in. Let's go talk to him before he gets drunk and starts angling for another mayoral run. <laughs> well, enjoy yourself tonight. Thank you. <laughs> oh, uh, hello again. I was looking for your husband. I didn't want to leave without saying thank you. Well, I haven't seen him. Where'd you come in? Okay, well, I guess I will uh, say thank you to you. That was a lovely evening. Well, it's snowing outside. Could I offer you some insulation from the cold? <sighs> thank you, but I was hoping to get home in time to watch the ball drop with my daughter. Oh, well, that's very important. I wish I could spend New Year's Eve with my son, but he's with my in-laws, and I've already called them four times. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing how much you miss them, isn't it? Mm. Mm. Why don't you come over for brunch tomorrow? I'd love to meet the whole family. Ah, well, it's um, just me and Amanda now. My wife is not with us anymore. I'm so sorry. No one should ever have to spend the holidays grieving. Thank you. I got you something. that life before and I can't live it again. Well, what about love? Can you live without that? Earlier today, he seemed extra tense. I think he knows what's coming. I've sent Daniel to his grandmother's for the weekend so I can finally put an end to it. Wow. This is really happening then? Yes. Come over after. You can finally meet Amanda. More importantly, she can finally meet you. I'll call you in. I'm on my way. Nine o'clock? Okay. David? I love you. I love you too. You missing something? Oh yeah, my PC. Could have sworn I brought it home. Well, maybe you left it at the office. Yeah, maybe. Listen, stay for breakfast. It's time that Amanda get to know you better. I wish I could, but I still haven't told Daniel that I'm leaving his father. Can we keep it a secret just a little while longer? Yeah, just a little bit longer. Oh. 